Jacqueline builds home for the flood victims. Uh, so basically, I have been working with Habitat for Humanity for about five years. And uh, this year, I was particularly concerned about the floods in Tamil Nadu. So uh, Habitat for Humanity helped me put together a build. And uh, we named the build Jacqueline Builds. Uh, but what we did not really actually expect was the amount of support and encouragement and help that we have been receiving from all over India. And uh, one such particular support was Pan by School. So um, my sincere thank you to everyone who donated, everyone who helped. It really is, um, sorry? Oh, okay. Uh, it's, you know, every little rupee, every little word of mouth, Every little awareness, um, you know, really helps. Every single one person volunteering helps. And, uh, you know, I, I'm so grateful that we have such people like Pan by College, uh, Pan by School, I keep calling you guys college, <laughs> Pan by School, uh, you know, who really do take an interest. And the great thing about this initiative and what they have done for Jacqueline Builds is uh, the children that they have actually inspired and they have actually educated about how important it is to actually have a home. So, um, yeah, so that's it. Jacqueline, you uh, आप श्रीलंका से हैं ऑलरेडी तो क्या जो कॉन्फ्लिक्ट्स चलते हैं तमिलनाडु या इंडिया और श्रीलंका के बीच उसके लिए आपका क्या टेक है क्या कहना चाहेंगे आप उस बात का आई एम एक्चुअली नॉट गोइंग टू बी स्ट्रेसिंग ऑन दैट एट ऑल बिकॉज़ वी आर ऑल हियर फॉर अ गुड कॉज एंड आई थिंक दैट यू नो जॉइंट एफर्ट्स पुटिंग ऑल दोस थिंग्स असाइड वी कैन मेक अ बिग डिफरेंस टू चेंज द वर्ल्ड uh hi uh jacqueline just like you are working for a great cause uh we at cnn and ibn have taken up a cause of this gentleman who's uh, who's a skating champion in the olympics for the disabled this time he wants to go to the us in 2018 and participate for the winter olympics a word of support would be really great if you can just uh, you know uh, encourage him and ask people to just uh, uh, fund him and support him 
I think, uh, you know, people who, uh, who are into sport and uh, need the encouragement, it's a very, very important thing for the country, uh, especially to encourage such people because they bring a lot of pride for the country and they also do it in a way to represent the country. So I really hope that he does make it to the US and I really hope that he comes back uh, with a gold medal. Uh, Jacqueline, uh, 9th April, you are going to Chennai and you are going to be a student with a campaign. If you want to tell us about that, what do you want to tell us about that? So basically, the build is happening on the 9th of April in Chennai. And we've located a place where we are going to be doing our build. We're hoping to achieve, um, hopefully, uh, homes for 10,000 families. So we are still looking at a lot of support from people, a lot of donations and volunteers. Uh, and uh, it's, it's, you know, I've done a build before. It's an amazing experience. You know, you go there, you actually build your home with the person who will be later receiving the home. And uh, you start from bottom up. So you're there carrying bricks, you're there putting cement, you get really dirty. You get, uh, you know, I mean, like it's, it's, it's hot, but there's a certain satisfaction at the end of the day when you're done with it because um, you feel really, really happy with the work you've done. You've really put your blood and sweat into it. And uh, the people that you hand over the keys to at the end of the day are so happy and so grateful for the, you know, um, I mean, support that you've given them that that is absolutely priceless. So that is happening on the 9th of April. There's a lot of information on the website, on the habitatindia.in website. And uh, my page is there, the Jacqueline Bills page is there. So um, people can read up about it and, you know, they can see any contribution helps. I mean, that's the most important thing. You know, if it's not money, it's volunteering. If it's not volunteering, it's awareness. If it's, you know, so any kind of contribution helps. Absolutely. I think our fraternity has been very supportive with each other. Uh, I think whenever there is someone from the industry who seeks help, um, for whatever, for their movies or for their promotions or for even causes, charities. Uh, I always feel like, um, you know, uh, Bollywood, like the film industry always stands up and they always stand up in solidarity and I love that actually about my industry. So uh, yes, I mean like already I've got a lot of support from a lot of my co-stars and people working with me and who have worked with me. So, um, you know, yeah, we, we're always there for each other, very important. Yes, I'm going to be at the Zoom Holi party. Partying for Holi. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Happy Holi, everyone. And see you on the 9th of April in Chennai for Jacqueline Bills. <laughs>Can the applause be louder? Thank you.
थैंक यू शेटी सो एंड मोहिनी मैम मिसेस पूर्णिमा मेहटा टू ऑनर आर हेड ऑफ एनजीओ मिस अनुराधा एंड जेनेट शेरा शी इज सी एफ ओ अनुराधा इज नेशनल हेड ऑफ हैबिटेट स्कूल प्रोग्राम शी हैज बीन वर्किंग फॉर द एजुकेशन एंड एनजीओ स्पेस फॉर लास्ट फिफ्टीन ईयर्स she has a fantastic track record of professional accomplishments and had held several leadership roles in student counseling team handling planning and strategy thank you principal ma'am <clears throat> allow me to extend warm greetings of the occasion to the media personals may i ask ms sapna ma'am and namrata ma'am to do the honors with a bouquet of flowers Meanwhile with the proceeding I welcome uh, principal of Little Angels High School is Mrs Nisha Chawan thank you ma'am for gracing the occasion So today our special guest for today's fundraising campaign is is any guesses definitely Mrs I mean Miss Jacqueline Fernandez so sorry ma'am uh, i'm so sorry now i would request our principal madam mrs purnima mehta to express and share her brief insight about this magnificent cause being a bollywood celebrity she has already also won the miss universe pageant 2006 for sri lanka she is also and a writer and also a philanthropist and let me tell you she is an intellectual with a graduate degree in Uh, in languages from university of australia <laughs> my dear students do you want to know more about her <laughs> all right so let me tell you she studied in bahrain in sacred heart school and she was always a brilliant student as a student she was always self motivated to do well and she already excelled in many fields during her school days so remember if you make her your role model you also have to excel in all fields will you do that uh you you must be amazed how she associated with many ngos and she is working for the various social cause tamil nadu flood uh, victims and she initially as you can all see there they have a goal to build 10000 houses for flood affected victims and at the initial stage they will be they will be requiring to build 1000 homes for tamil nadu affected victims because their homes have been completely destroyed by the floods and there will be a requirement of repairs of 9000 houses Do you know how much funds will be required for this so the estimated cost for new construction would be approximately INR 5 lakhs per home 
and for the repairs estimated cost would be uh, thank you so for this cause Banba International School has joined hands with Jacqueline Bills and Habitat Humanity India. I say with, a, with pride that all our students have contributed toward this cause and we have collected a whooping amount of 2.73 lakhs. Let me tell you, through this partnership, our students are learning le lessons of their social responsibility. They are already started volunteering towards the homeless people. I still remember some children coming to me and saying that, ma'am, we want to build houses for these people. So they are already aware that they are the most privileged lot when compared to people who don't have homes and who do not have food to eat. So the all already support throughout this campaign and that is how we could make this day and this day is a proud moment for Panba International School. Uh, once again, a big thank you Ms. Fernandez and all the best wishes from the staff, students, and management of Panba International School. Thank you so much. I correct myself, it's 2,72,000. I request media personnel to be to make the function very smooth. My thanks to all the dignitaries and special thanks to Ms. Jacqueline Fernandez. Yes. The check is basically a replica of the bricks and the support which we all Panbites would like to extend for the welfare of the society as we consider this as our social and moral responsibility. It is a matter of pride to announce the name of the top donors of the BRICS, all for the cause of humanity. May I request Ms. Jacqueline Fernandez one more time to honor our top donors. In the list, we are having two top donors. The first one is Tavisha Kaup, Twisha Kaup from Senior KGA. She has donated bricks worth rupees 10,000. That means it comes to 2,000 bricks. 2,000 bricks. Second in the list is Pranav Sale, senior KGB, with 1,000 bricks.
May I request media to keep safe distance? Kindly disperse off towards the stage. Yeah, I have announced. The second child is Pranav Salis, Junior KGB, 1000 bricks. So they are our top donors. May I request media? Let's proceed ahead with the show. Thank you so much, Spanbai College, Spanbai School, for having me here today. Uh, I go to many events, but today is a very, very special and one of my most special events because I'm here with all of you. And uh, being such young children, uh, it's amazing to see your support and your interest in the cause that we are doing for Tamil Nadu flood victims. So, I want to tell you all something. You are all very privileged to have a home. And I hope you know that. Do you know that? That you have a home, you have a roof over your head, you have a floor, you have bathrooms, you have a bed to sleep on. You know how lucky you are? Very lucky, very lucky. And there are a lot of people now who are suffering with no home. So imagine if you don't have a home to go to. So that is why you have helped a lot of people actually now have a home. So I want you to now give yourself a big round of applause. And that's why today is a very, very special day for me to be here with you because are you still clapping for yourself? Yeah? <laughs> so it's very special for me to be here today because without your help, we would not be able to do this charity and we'd not be able to go and help other people. So each one of you, whatever you've done, just your contribution, your support is a big deal. So please remember that. And also, um, what I wanted to share with you is uh, Habitat for Humanity, which it's not just about what funding you're giving us, it's also about your contribution in, volu in volunteering. Okay, so we do need a lot of volunteers and we appreciate all of you for doing that. Your word of mouth really helps as well. And um, thank you members of the board for having me here and for your support, it's been amazing. Thank you Anuradha, she is the lady who got me into Habitat for Humanity. And um, I know all of you all are in school right now, but I wanna say something. Please do well in school because you only get to go to school once in your life. And when that's over, trust me on this and you will remember what I tell you. You'll want to come back to school. So just remember, have the best time of your best time that you can. Be good to your teachers. Study hard. Make yourself proud. Forget anyone else. Make yourself proud. So that in years later, when you're done with school, you can say, yeah. But I was amazing in school. I was really good in school. So make sure you do that as well. And um, whenever you can, help people. Give to people. And uh, remember, it's the most beautiful thing you can do as a human being. So help and give. I hope you guys remember that. Yeah? Thank you. Before I say thank you, I would like Ms. Jacqueline Fernandez to hand over a frame to our principal ma'am, Mrs. Purnima Mehta. Thank you so much. I would like to express my gratefulness towards all the passionate people present here who will surely bring a big change with this unconditional love for the mankind.
So, we all are thankful for this contribution and the way you all have taken this show. This will definitely be helpful for the mankind for structuring many homes which will make them live in a better way. My one question to everyone, finally, it's a rhetoric question. What is a brick? Anyone who would like to answer? I will make it easy for you. It's an icon of strong, promising, promising, passionate foundation laid by you. It takes 1,400 bricks to build a toilet and 15,000 to build up a home. On behalf of Pan by International School, I would like to thank all the dignitaries present here. My special thank to Ms. Jacqueline Fernandez and to all the dignitaries, uh, our school managers is Ms. Nisha Chawan, Mrs. Nilanjana Shetty, Mr. Piyush Shetty and our very own principal ma'am, Mrs. Purnima Mehta. Moreover, CFO, Ms. Janet. Please, please. Oh, oh, mama, mama, you are here. You are not going to do